Hi, it's Michael Q. Todd here, and this is Chief. Say hello, Chief. Woof, woof. Hey. Hi, this is Chief. So, we're here on the Gold Coast in Australia. It's really good to talk to you again. I've just got a couple of thoughts that I'd like to run by you that I really assumed that everyone knew. So, on Facebook, you can go to the place called Friends tab at the top of your friends profile page, and this is where you usually add friends. And I've got my best friend here now, so you've got some close friends. And maybe it's good to work with a circle of about 30 to 50 people who are sharing your stuff a lot and share theirs back. And if you're the first one to comment in a thread, it often gives a bit of a spark. How often have you visited your friends' places and no one's commented at all on a photo that they put up or their status update? So you can give them a big hand. So <laughs> try this. Try clicking on the close friends and take away the acquaintances default setting on the Facebook. Now, I just want to, while I've got your attention and I've given some value of that, I'd just like to give another thing that is happening to me on the internet and I'd like to share with you and you probably spend most of your time on Facebook. I'd, I'd suggest that there are three other communities that you might like to get involved in and these are my three favourites. One of them is Empire Avenue and you can find me in the link above, Empire Avenue forward slash Michael Q. Todd and another two are Scoop It and in Scoop It you can have five topics so you don't follow a person you actually follow topics. Now this is also a community and it, it helps, it's a curating content community and it's a sharing community as well and it's absolutely incredible. And the other one of course is Triber which is a blogging community where you join different tribes that are in your niche and you blog and when you blog other people in your tribe share your stuff and you reciprocate for them. And this has led to me recently today of just having 30,000 views on a blog post that I wrote about Google Plus, my nine Google Plus tips. Google Plus is the big buzz for 2012, so if you're not on there, please have a look at these tips and, and check that out. Now, when I was back in the old days about nine months ago, and I wasn't using Empire Avenue, and I wasn't using Triber, and I wasn't using Scoop It, 30,000 views on a blog post that took me 20 minutes to write, I couldn't imagine it. Like, if you had told me that I would get 300 views, I'd be over the moon.